So what happens when you lose tracking? You're playing a game, Beat Saber, Supernatural, and your bats are just going everywhere uh, in a minute. Again, it doesn't have to be these games. You could be playing something else and lose uh, tracking. So let's talk about the main causes for uh, your controllers not working properly. Uh, the first one is batteries, okay? If your batteries are low, there's a high chance you're gonna start losing tracking. Um, I've heard that anything below 10% uh, will start causing this issue. So keep an eye on your batteries, uh, on your controllers. It will show up on your home um, screen. You can see at the bottom left, it will show you how much battery you have, battery you have left on the the headset and how much on each one of the controllers. Also the voltage for the batteries. Um, 1.5 volts is the ideal uh, ones for the controller, so keep that in mind. The other thing is lighting. Um, your headset is uh, basically identifying where the controllers are based on whatever system they use, doesn't really matter right now, but it requires lighting, right? So it's looking at the controllers and identifying where they are, how they're moving. Therefore, you have to look for two things. It can't be dark. <laughs> that sounds basic, doesn't it? But it can't be too dark. I remember my husband telling me one day, hey, you want me to just turn the light off because you're playing? I'm like, no, you can't, because otherwise my controllers will stop working. We just think that we're in this you know, uh, reality inside the VR and that the surroundings aren't important, but the reality is they are. So, uh, and the second thing is reflections. Any, if the sun is coming through the windows um, too much, or if you have a mirror or any sort of other element that is reflecting that can cause the tracking issues as well. So keep that in mind. The third thing that you need to pay attention to are these tiny little cameras over here. So you have four in your headset and these cameras should be clean. Now, I know what you're thinking. Uh, how can I clean, how can I clean them? And when should I clean them and all that? But I know for a fact that especially doing my exercises, uh, my hands are sweating. I'm kind of, you know, touching my headset every now and then, you know, arranging myself back on um, my uh, mat uh, in between songs, for example, in one of the games that I play. And I know that I'm most likely rubbing those cameras with dirty hands, sweaty hands. And so keep those clean. You can use the same um, cloth that you use to wipe your lenses to clean these every now and then because some of your tracking issues may just be because these cameras are not clean enough. So lighting, batteries, keep the cameras clean.